Chapter 14, The Return of the Enemy The tension in the air was noticeable as the team recovered in their temporary shelter. The revelation of the Duchess' dark past and her connection to the Alliance had left a deep mark on her thoughts. Despite the surprise and confusion they had experienced, there was a shared feeling of eagerness to face what lay ahead. As they chatted quietly, an alert on their communication devices brought them out of their thoughts. It was a coded message, a cryptic warning indicating that the Shadow Alliance was aware of their location and was rapidly approaching. Roman's expression turned grim as he realized that the fight was not over yet and that they were about to face a new challenge. The ominous coded warning that reached their communication devices made it clear that they were vulnerable. As they took refuge in their temporary hiding place, the team struggled to understand how this discovery had occurred. Dr. Nova, with her technical skill, scrutinized the shelter's security and communication systems for possible vulnerabilities. Every step of the operation to recover the codex had been carried out with extreme caution, which made the fact that the Alliance had located them all the more baffling. As they whispered about how their enemy had discovered his whereabouts, they considered the possibility that someone within the organization might have betrayed them. This worrying idea created tensions within the team, as they couldn't be sure who they could trust. As the team continued arguing, a distant noise was heard, the sound of rapidly approaching engines. The hurried footsteps of the Alliance members echoed through the halls, and the team prepared for an imminent confrontation. The sudden arrival of the Alliance agents made them realize that their enemy had not only been quick to discover their location, but had also acted quickly to carry out a surprise counterattack. Wasting no time, the team prepared for the imminent confrontation. They knew that the Alliance would not stop until they were eliminated or the Codex was recovered. Hit, with his Generation 8 upgrades, showed renewed confidence in his combat and stealth abilities. The conversation focused on the strategy to follow, how to defend against a surprise attack from an enemy that had so many resources. As the lights in the shelter went out and shadows covered their figures, the team heard approaching footsteps and whispers. The whispering voices and footsteps of various individuals echoed in the hallway, revealing the arrival of the Alliance members. In a moment of tension, Roman gave the signal and the team dispersed into the shadows to ambush the intruders. The fighting that followed was intense and fierce. Roman, Hit, Dr. Nova and the Duchess once again demonstrated their skill and coordination as they faced off against Alliance agents. The hallways of the shelter became a dark, claustrophobic battlefield, with banging, gunshots, and the whirring of weapons filling the air. In the midst of the chaos, Roman came face to face with an Alliance agent, an individual wearing a distinctive emblem. In the brief exchange, Roman discovered that this enemy was one he had previously faced. The revelation came as a shock, and Roman was driven by a mixture of fury and fortitude. The confrontation began with a barrage of gunshots and explosions that filled the air with deafening booms. Alliance members spread out from the shadows, firing volleys of bullets that whistled through the air as the team took cover behind pillars and supply crates. Dr. Nova used her cloaking device to conceal herself momentarily, while Hit used her advanced processing unit, executing calculations and tactics at superhuman speed to counter the enemy offensive and prepare a precise strategy to counterattack. The tension was visible, and the team fought with all their might to repel the assault. Flashes of gunfire illuminated the shadowy underground hallway, revealing tense, sweaty faces as they tried to stay undercover. Roman, with his multi-phase in hand, fired with precision at the attackers, while the Duchess showed unwavering bravery as she faced the threat with a pistol in each hand. The Alliance members were formidable, but the team demonstrated their skill and experience in combat. Dr. Nova emerged from her camouflage to launch stunning devices, momentarily disorienting the attackers. Hit, with movements so agile they seemed to defy the laws of physics, dove into the fray with methodical precision. His tactical analysis system allowed him to evaluate in milliseconds the best strategy for each opponent. In the blink of an eye, he deflected incoming attacks, dodging sharp blades and unleashing punches and kicks at lightning speed. His high-speed processor calculated the exact force needed to neutralize his opponents without causing fatal damage. Martial techniques fused with cybernetic technology as Hit performed a deadly dance amidst the chaos. 
His motion sensors detected every enemy movement, and his reaction ability was amazing. In a single moment, he managed to incapacitate several of them, disarming them with surgical precision. Hit Symphony of Combat was a masterpiece of precision and advanced technology that left his enemies perplexed and in awe of his skill. The battle was intense and fierce, and the passageway was filled with the smoke and sound of fighting. After a prolonged and exhausting confrontation, they managed to neutralize their attackers. The Alliance members lay on the ground, unarmed and incapacitated. The team took a brief breath, their breaths ragged and the smell of gunpowder filling the air. They had secured the shelter, but the fighting had taken a heavy toll on their energy and courage. But the implications of this counterattack were not lost on them. The Shadow Alliance was determined to recover the Codex and eliminate all who stood in their way. With the shelter now compromised, the team faced a moral dilemma about how to proceed. Their decisions would affect the future of Salonia and the fate of the Codex.